Now I like to use a 180 grit file when I file my fill-ins. When you use a 100 grit file to file the sides, every time you do a fill, your free edge is going to get thinner and thinner and thinner and you're going to have breaking problems. So let's just use a 180. That's all we get. Left side, five steps in filing. Right side, free edge. Left side, right side, free edge. Okay, that's one, two, three. Step number four. If I was doing all ten, I'd do all the left sides, then come back, do all the right sides, then all my free edges. Now step number four, we're going to do the top of the nail. Bevel down on the side, across the top, down on the other side. When I get done filing, you're going to see I have no fill line. When you file instead of nip and your client buffs in between fills, you will not get a fill line. This will look like a brand new nail. Bevel down on the side, cross the top, down on the side. Make sure you get all the way around that little road. Make it a beautiful, smooth little cuticle area. Bevel down on the side, cross the top, down on the side. Beautiful. Bevel down on the side, cross the top, down on the side. Step number four on both nails. Bevel down on the side, cross the top, down on the side. Get around that cuticle area. Get it nice and smooth. You want to have a beautiful cuticle area so you have no lifting, nothing for the client to pick at. Now turn the nail around from the client's angle. Step number five. Bevel down. Make fills fun because fills are where you make all your money.